Welcome to another episode of Termical Talk with me, Steven Spice. On today's episode, I will be sitting down with a man who always knows what's up and hosts his own game show that I would love to be on myself one day because I have seen almost every episode. So to say that I am making, marking out, sitting down right here introducing him please welcome to the show one half of the 2012 pwa tag team of the year two-time wwf hardcore champion my kind of title to win two-time united states champion one time wwe tag team champion the winner of two slammy awards one of the hosts of the show rock talk the man who knows what's up, the 52-time champion of the 24-7 championship, Mr. Ron Killings! Killings! <laughs> A.K.A. <laughs> WWE Superstar, Art Drew! <laughs> and the crowd goes, wow, <laughs> ah, Art Drew, ah, Ron Killings, Art Drew, how they get confused. Ah, oh, you look just the same. They look alike. They're twins. All right. I almost just spit out of my nose. <laughs> that would have been good. That would have no, been great. Would have. <laughs> it would have been splendid. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the show, Ron. How are you? Thank you. Thank you. Oh, welcome to the show, Ron. How are, how, how, what's up today? Hey, man. Thank you for having me, Stephen. Man, everything is up today, you know? What's not up? <laughs> I mean, I'm, I have stuff going on, man. I can, I can right? Today. You're I up, right? I don't have anything going on. I can do this all day, man. I can see You're you. Up. I'm up in the big leagues now. Boom. <laughs> I got our truth. I got Ron, aka Ron Killings. Yes. Man, I can stay here all day. I'm all, I'm out to the big leagues now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I I put you in the big league. I like that. I like that. Okay. We are getting to a SmackDown. Sorry, sorry. I have some some raw talk about crazy world of wrestling. Uh, what is your favorite thing about being a wrestler? Mm. Meeting people all over the world like you. I mean, I'm in Toronto. You can come to the Toronto whenever you want, man. Huh? You can come to Toronto whenever you want. I'm in Toronto. Come on, man. <laughs> I love it. Connect, man. You gotta connect. You gotta connect. Yes. That would be crazy, right? You have won many championships over the years, which championship means most to you and why 24 7 championship means the most to me i mean yeah why you know, because it has connected me it has connected me with different walks of celebrities um sports announcers race car drivers uh basketball players football players that's true because they got to rappers pay. singers like uh, it's, it, it connects and it does more than just it's more than just a wrestling belt it's, it's, it's a universal bell. I, I love it. Where did you get the idea for a little Jimmy to come from? Where did little Jimmy come from? Wow. You remember little Jimmy? Um, little Jimmy actually came from the fans made little Jimmy. I just looked beside myself and started talking. And somebody pointed and said, he's talking to little Jimmy right there. And... Little Jimmy was born right there on TV beside me. Imagine that. <laughs> a, lot, a lot of characters plays, a lot of your character plays off the fans' reaction. How hard is it, was it, was your job during COVID 
without live fans in the stands? Um, it was hard, but it wasn't hard. Um, a lot of people don't know to get a job as a professional wrestler when you audition, a lot of times there's no audience. But you have to you have to wrestle, you have to audition like there is one. So it's almost like we went back to our roots. And and the guys did a tremendous job of like handling it through the situation uh, with COVID and everything. But I think it was um a lot of guys just it just we just went back to our roots. A lot of the girls went back to our roots. Look at my eyes. I just got eye drops yesterday. Look how look how um What's it called? Dilated they are. Dilated? Oh, they are dilated big time. Yep. Oh, my bear is going dead. If like you that. could take on any opponent and win the belt from them, who, what championship would you like to win from a wrestler, not the 24-7 belt? I'd take on Roman Reigns and win the Universal Championship. How about that? Yes. 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 Okay. Now... Besides Drake Maverick and Akira Tozawa, which per, which wrestler would you love to start a feud with? Any wrestler from now on and the, and and the, and back in time. Miz. Okay, now back in time. The Rock. Okay. I, oh, what is it? Pop up question. What does it feel to wrestle your hero, your childhood, your hero, growing up, John Cena? Dream come true. I can't wrestle because of my condition, but I would love to be a ref, manager, or even a talk show host like you. Do you have Do you have any advice that you could give me to help me improve? Uh, only advice I could give you, Stephen is to continue to be exactly who you are now with the energy you have. Everything you, you have about yourself is perfect. Everything about you is perfect. You've kept me, you've, you've kept me entertained. You've kept me on my toes and you know what you're doing. And you're funny. Charisma. You're captivating, you're captivating. I have charisma, I have charisma. You do have charisma and you know it, see? See that? Kevin Owens actually told me told me I had charisma. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. See, where I come from, they would say you a mess. <laughs> but it's a good thing, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, that's all the time we have that we have for today. Everyone, I want to say a huge thank you to our truth for coming on my show today and showing us what's up. It meant so much to me to, and truly, oh, I didn't even mean to put truly. This is it, something <laughs> I will never forget. Do you have any final words to, for my viewers, Archers? Hey, thank you for having me on and continue to not give up. Exactly. And follow your dreams. Can you do one what's up for me, please? You got it. What's up? What's up? <laughs> if you want to see more videos like this, guys, then make sure to, to truth axe on that like button and a lie detector on that subscribe button. It, but if you don't want the tr a truth or a quanti consequence, I laid on you. Make sure to have all notifications on. Until next time, guys. Uh, oh, bye, everyone. Remember to always be yourself. Bye. Be yourself and you'll get up to where you want in your dreams. You'll get very successful. Bye. That's what's up. Bye-bye.